One of the most popular ghost stories is the urban legend of the vanishing phantom hitchhiker, where a motorist picks up a hitchhiker who mysteriously vanishes without explanation. A particularly enduring version of this tale involves a ghostly hitchhiker from North Carolina known as Lydia, the Vanishing Lady. The story goes that on a rainy night in 1923, a young woman named Lydia traveled to Raleigh to attend a dance with her boyfriend. The couple was driving home to High Point on Highway 70 when they collided with another car at a narrow underpass. Lydia was killed instantly and happened to be wearing a white evening gown that night. Ever since then, there have been numerous sightings of a female hitchhiker at that location wearing that exact outfit. One notable sighting involved a motorist named Burke Hardison. He was driving near the underpass one night when he saw a woman in a white evening gown signaling for help. Hardison picked her up, and the frantic woman said she needed to get home to High Point, since her mother would be worried. She provided her home address, but when Hardison arrived at the house, the girl completely vanished. Nonetheless, Hardison decided to go knock on the door. A woman answered. After hearing Hardison's story, she told him that her daughter, Lydia, had been killed in an accident at the underpass. Apparently, Hardison was not the first person who had shown up at Lydia's house to describe this experience. While the story sounds like a folk tale, researchers have uncovered a death certificate of a 19-year-old High Point girl named Lydia, who died in a car accident on December 31, 1923. The Legend of Lydia the Vanishing Lady continues to live on, 